Hey, it's Bethany and Olivia from the Flack Fam, and today we are reminiscing about a Barca Stadium tour at Camp Nou. My dad and I are major soccer fans, so we couldn't be in Barcelona and not go see Camp Nou. Even though I may not be a huge soccer fan, besides watching Olivia play, this place was inspiring. From the moment you walk into the building, there is a feeling of excitement. We went into the museum first. There are so many trophies, jerseys, and of course Messi has his own area. I knew Lionel Messi was a good soccer player, but I had no idea how many awards he personally has won. And all of the pretty gold ones really caught my eye. He has won a gold ball, golden boots, and a golden crown. Mom, that's why they call him the GOAT. Why would you call him a GOAT? It stands for greatest of all time. He started playing at Barcelona at 17 years old, and when he tried to retire, Argentina begged him to come back, and because he did come back at age 35, which is old for a football player, he helped his team win the FIFA World Cup in 2022. I do remember watching the World Cup. It was amazing. We should probably move on because Messi wasn't the only cool thing here. Oh yes, we have got to go backstage and out onto the field. Backstage, I think you mean the press area, locker rooms, and players' tunnel. There really was a feeling of excitement walking down that player's tunnel onto the field. Did that field make you want to play? It was cool to see in person, and if invited, I would play on that field in a heartbeat. They did have a virtual experience that we didn't do, but I bet you would have felt like you were playing then, or maybe like you were just watching them play. They were having people sit in the bleachers with the virtual glasses on, so I don't think they were playing soccer. These people are doing the virtual reality right now. On our way to the gift shop, we walked through a room that was full of screens showcasing highlights of games. It was amazing to watch and I was so happy for FC Barcelona that I actually shed a few tears. It was a very well put together video. You were crying during the video? Just a little bit. Maybe we should move on to the gift shop. This is more than your run of the mill gift shop. It was two stories and a sitting area where they had videos playing of FC Barcelona's women's team. That video was done well too and made me feel happy emotions. Did you cry there too? Let's not talk about it. Let's talk about the store and how much you loved it. There was so much I could have bought here and for soccer merch, it wasn't priced too horribly. I actually started to try to find the most expensive thing in the store, thinking that some shoes or clothing would be extremely expensive. You'll be surprised at what the most expensive thing we actually found. Can't find the price. This one is 95. So your shoes still win. Yeah, the shoes will always win, Mom. How much are these? $2.29, but those should be a uh, lot more. Okay. Full weather. Watch it. $49. I'm still winning. I'm still winning. Look, this is still more. That's what we looked at. 270 right? Yeah. Yeah. Can you find it? One fifty five. Oh, that's a high, higher priced jersey. Legos are still winning. Regular price. Let's see. This one? Do this one. How much is this one? Well, Legos still win. $94.99. It's Nike, Mom. Try higher. They don't have a price on that. Find a price. We must know a price. Shoes. Hugs. Move your fingers. 
Lego set wins. It's free $29.99. Lego set wins! How much is it? Three thirty. <laughs> Those Legos were awesome, and maybe a collector's item someday since they started the redevelopment of Camp Nou in June of 2022. It's crazy that Camp Nou is the largest stadium in Europe, and they are making it even larger. I think the retractable roof will be a great addition. You sat at several soccer games that have been cold or hot. Did you hear the new name will be Spotify Camp Nou? I guess we know who's paying for the new stadium. Can you still visit the stadium? As far as I can tell from the websites that sell the stadium tours, you can still get tickets and see the stadium, but definitely make sure tickets are available before you go. If you have a football fan and you are in Barcelona, we recommend you stop at Camp Nou. Even if you are not a fan, but really want to see more of Barcelona culture, football is a big deal here. Don't forget to subscribe, share, and comment. Thanks for doing this vlog with me, Olivia, and thanks to all of you for watching. Bye!